I, you guys know the rule. I have to do this in the car so that I remember to put the clicker back. Clicker says 82 and my total was a little over 75 bucks. So all in all, not terrible. I am kind of cheating this week, if you can call it that, because one of the meals I'm making is already in my freezer, but you know, I'm trying to work through the food in my freezer a little bit at a time because I'm not trying to have it overstuffed like I did all of last year. All right, back from Walmart and running all my other errands. I thought I would throw that in this video because I don't run enough errands to the point where it can be its own video. So anyways, I'm gonna show you guys what I got. Nutty Buddies. I swear to God, this package is smaller. Shrinkflation, I hate you. But French Vanilla Almond Granola, this is the best absolute best and then I noticed at least at my Walmart after they had the recalls with all the Quaker oats like granola bars they just completely pulled them off the shelves like they don't even have the mylars for them anymore like the the tags on the shelves so they just replaced it with like all great value stuff so I'm kind of picky with like tastes and textures and yeah I got this instead because this I know I actually like and then a red oh ooh, don't fall don't fall I got dishes right next to me one red onion which is going to be for one of the recipes that I'm making this week which I'm doing the La Scala salad it's like a La Scala chopped salad and I guess it was made popular by the Kardashians I don't really care about the Kardashians it just sounded really good because it's basically like an Italian sub but like in salad form and then I'm also doing chicken stir fry but I have all the ingredients for that in my freezer so not a big deal all right moving on this is on sale and these are honestly my favorite, the caramel rice cakes. So freaking good. This, I just, I wanted some again. This was on sale. Little baby bag of ladies. Because I only went to Walmart. <clears throat> Excuse me, this time I didn't feel like going to like Walmart and Sam's Club. Muddy Buddies because they are the best. Same thing with Chex Mix the best all right then I got it's kind of slim pickings for nanners but I got two 
bunches of nanners because these are going to be part of my breakfast. And then I've been obsessed lately with mandarin oranges. So I got another five pound bag of those. Then this is for that chopped salad I'm making this week. But I got two things of iceberg lettuce. And it's funny because the Spanish word for lettuce is lechuga. And that's exactly how it came up when I rang it up. And I just thought it was funny because, you know, I don't know. Like, it doesn't come up as lettuce. It comes up as lechuga. And I was, like, kind of thinking about how funny it would be for a majority of the people around here. If everything, like, when it popped up, came up in Spanish and they would have, like, no idea what anything was saying. I don't know. I just thought it was kind of a funny idea. Then my on and off again obsession, Dan and Light and Fit Greek yogurt in the lemon cream flavor. So freaking good. I just wish it came in a pack of five or like a pack of like 10 or something like that. Then I got a thing of plain non-fat yogurt. I'm not eating this. Well, not technically because I'm actually using this to make yogurt. So I looked at it and I, I thought about this. I'm on a yogurt kick again. And my favorite one is the vanilla Greek yogurt, like just the great value brand. But it's like $3.54 for a tub, like a tub this size. So 32 ounces and it's almost four bucks. And I was like, I'm a smart lady. I was like, I'm a smart lady and I'm low key a homemaker. So I got not one, not two, but three gallons of milk. Two of these are going to be for like drinking, whatever, breakfast, whatever. Sometimes I just like to have a glass of milk, you know, whatever. And then the last gallon is actually going to be for yogurt. So I'm not making that until tomorrow because right now I don't really have time. But I also got some mozzarella, which is also going to be for that chopped salad. But yeah, I'm, I should have should have been like making my yogurt continuously. But, you know, you, you go through lulls and it just I got tired and whatever. But now my desire to save money and to really save a lot of extra cash, like as much as possible, is kind of outweighing everything else. So yeah, fun fact, I actually saved, well, I have saved almost four grand at this point. And since my birthday last year, I've saved over 2,500 bucks. So I'm pretty stoked about that because I don't think I've ever saved this much at one time, which sounds really sad. And honestly it is, but it's the truth. Hot sauce, I got crystals this time. Only because A, it's cheaper. And B, I've been using Franks for like, what, the last three, four years. And I was like, I, I need something different. You know, I need something that's like actually spicy. And that is not like so vinegary. Still love Frank's, but Crystal's is just mm, chef's kiss. And it's cheaper. Apple juice because I refuse to be the type of household that does not have appy juice. This was on sale. It's the Alani Cherry Twist. I'm only going to get like four hours of sleep today. So I figured, why not? These were also on sale. And I've never had these flavors so I got the Bang Energy Cotton Candy, and then this one is Rainbow Unicorn. It's probably going to taste like, like a nerd's rope threw up. That's kind of what I'm anticipating. So I don't know. We'll see. But I like the Bang Energy ones because they have more caffeine in them than just like a Red Bull. Red Bull is like peanuts, honestly. And then these were also on sale, Pepsi Zero Sugar and Diet Mountain Dew 
because I never really partake. So yeah, that's, that's everything I got still with money to spare, as you guys saw, and picked up all my meds, picked up my groceries, picked up my pine pellets for my cats. So I literally don't have to do shit except clean and cook this weekend. So I'm really excited about that. It's almost 10 o'clock. If you're wondering, yes, I did all of this on a Thursday. And unfortunately, every Thursday will now become the bane of my existence because the director that I work for has decided that we need to have meetings at 3.30 p.m. when I don't get there till 8 p.m. So it's, it's so much fun. Oh my God, I love it. Yeah. So I do have a phone interview tomorrow. So I don't wanna be rushing around tomorrow. I'd rather rush around today because I'm not gonna get any sleep anyways. So yeah, here we are. But very proud of the fact that I've saved that much money. I mean, honestly, I'm just, I'm stoked. And I also found a new park near me. Like, it's, there's like three different ways that I can get to CVS from my house. And one of the ways is kind of like a back road. And there's like, I think it's a high school. Yeah, whatever, something like that. There's like a school near there, don't care. But there's also like a municipal park. And I saw this lady walking and they have like a little track. And I was like, yo, I was like, I should, I should do that. So I think tomorrow, if the weather's good enough, I'm going to take myself for a nice, long, sunny, hopefully sunny walk. And just get some fresh air. So anyways, I hope you guys are having a great start to the month of March. And yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I love you all. And I'll talk to you in my next video. Bye guys.